Aquarians, let's see what's going on. The week is from the 23rd of December until the 29th. I want to say um, thanks to all the supporting Aquarians who have supported my channel. And I want to say to you guys, um, what you guys do not understand, and this is why this channel, this channel was set up, is to understand, let people understand who they are and why you were born on the certain signs. Fire sign people, especially you, um, <laughs> Aries, fire sign people, especially you, Aries, are the ones that help other people to clear karmas, okay? There are certain people that are not here with karmas, so um, the most of people that was born are, Ari are Aries and Cancers, okay? So the most of people who were born are Aries and Cancers. So let's see what is coming up for you um aquarians in this week this week is a week of new beginning so let's see what is coming up so aquarians and moon and rising sign we're calling up on the universal angels and guides so i see um in this week we have the latest 45 years and older so um it is the week of christmas so Obviously that these people are up. So whatever is happening and transpiring, I see um, the latest 45 years and older is up in this week. Okay. So it is Christmas. Uh, um, obviously. Then I see the energy of uh, the four of swords. I see people are taking time off. I think I better put my glasses on. <laughs> Um, people are taking um, time off so of course it is a time of resting for you guys because it's the time of Christmas so uh, a lot of people are taking time off and this is going to be good so um, let's see what is what else is coming off some of you are thinking about turning your back on something moving forward whatever the issue and the situation is I see as if, yeah, you're thinking, hey, um, this is enough. I'm letting go of something, okay? I see the oracle is here. So whatever is transpiring in this week, the oracle is coming up. Some of you could be listening to your own intuition in this week. But some of you could also be around your grandmom. And this is someone who is going to be giving you some wise um, advice, okay? <clears throat> so your grandmom could be a grandmom or father could be around giving you some wise advice i see a lot of conflicts i see conflicts of the mind conflicts you're having inner conflicts i see mostly inner conflicts is going on um for you guys whatever is transpiring whatever the information i see inner conflicts whatever the inner conflicts is there is definitely a lot that is going on okay I see the mother of nurturing. So I see that you latest 45 years and older is going to be there nurturing. Um, everyone is there. Everyone is celebrating. This is going to be good. It's a very, very positive week. It is a week where a lot of you are taking uh, or standing back. I see emotion, emotion with a, um, a Pisces, Cancer, or a Scorpion, whatever the issue, the situation is. I see emotion with this person. Whatever that is happening and transpiring, some of you could be dealing with a Pisces, a Cancer, or a Scorpion, and there's a lot of emotional worries that is going on. There is so much emotional worries that is going on um, with this person. So this person could be your child, okay? Or um, this person could be, it could be your child, or um it could be um you men um between the age of 18 and 45 there is really some um worries that is coming up i see some of you are going to be turning your backs to a situation and move forward so it is a week it is a week it is a week it is a week so what we're seeing here is that i see some of you um people between the age of 18 and 45 is so um tired and you're tired of dealing with um a worrisome situation and it has to do with a, um um a pisces cancer or a scorpion um i see a lot of you are listening to your intuition or going in and having inner conflicts so i see um 
the energy of inverse and what this is doing is that I see some of you women are really going within and trying to figure out something so whatever is happening to the women 45 years and older I see you're going in within to try and figure out something whatever is transpiring I see conflicts I see you women are really having conflicts with other people so of course it's a week of Christmas so there could be um, different uh, voices over how things to be done so I see you having conflicts with people I see worries I see sadness and some of you could be um, having some sadness and just staying away from people some of you maybe wanted to go home and couldn't get to go home that sort of a thing so you're having some sadness and staying away I see new love is coming in I see some of you could be having conflicts with a new love I see you're having conflicts with your children that sort of a thing and I see you're very worried some of you ladies because you haven't heard anything from your child's father okay the director of metal is here whatever the issue and the situation is I see some of you are deciding to turn your back on an Aquarius Gemini or Libra whoever this person is and whatever is going on I see you're turning your back to an Aquarius Gemini or Libra for some of you that was an, an investigation is going on I see you men are very worried and you have some regrets and sadness whatever is transpiring I see you men um, all ages having some worry and having regret and sadness so the energy of the Oracle is here and I see that some of you could be incarcerated and want to go home uh, this is coming up that some of you are uh, incarcerated and want to go home some of you feel trapped some of you wants to just be with your family so there is a lot that is going there obviously some of you just want to be with your family or want to be with the love of your life so that sort of an energy is definitely coming up the worries is going to be over whatever the issue the situation is I see this worries is going to be over there is a lot of worries that is happening but I see this worries is going to be over I see some of you are worried about um, a businessman this is a um, a Taurus Virgo or Capricorn whoever this businessman is and whatever I see you're worried about this person <clears throat> so whatever the issue and the situation is that is going on I see you very worried about this person the energy of the Empress is here and I see that some of you are um, are going to be gifting your mom something very beautiful something that she wasn't expected I see if you are in a relationship with a Pisces cancer or a scorpion between the ages of 18 and 35 I see wonderful gifts wonderful surprises I see this could be a new love coming in for you I see a calling is coming up so some information is going to be coming in and the information is going to be coming in from a young um, Pisces cancer or scorpion this person it could be your child so I see a lot of you if your child is a Pisces cancer or scorpion they are going to be coming home for Christmas and I see a lot of connection between you and this person I see a lot of healing and balance so uh, the director of emotions is here and the director and the quest of emotion now the director is someone 45 years and older and the quest of emotions I see a new start is coming up for you and this person whoever this person is whether it's a brother whether it's a sister whoever this person is I see really a new start is coming up for you and this person whatever that happened and transpire I definitely definitely see a new start coming up for you and this person so people who have kids who are Pisces cancer scorpion or people who have kids on the whole I see most of you your your kids most of you for you your kids are coming home I see affection of love I see an open heart that is coming up I see some of you men are regretting doing something whatever it is I see a lot of you men um, regretting doing something I see the energy of uh, some of you young men is um, 
heartbroken because you wish and hope that you could have connected to someone. There is someone that you wish and hope to connect with. Some of you between the age of 18 and 45 is missing your partner. I think they went home and you are with your family. I see you missing your partner. I see an end is coming to the worries, but that it has to do. If your father is a Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn, I see the worries is coming um, to you where this person, whoever this person is, whatever they have done, I see that the worries is going to be over. I see that some of you realize that it is the energy of a Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn, whatever they have done and created these worries around you. So there's a lot of love, emotional connection that is coming up for you guys. A lot of love, a lot of emotional connection. For you ladies, 45 years and older, I see you're going within. You have conflicts with people outside. I see you are going to be receiving some information from your child. Um, and it is positive. It is this, whatever is transpiring, I see you offering something. All right, when we look, we see a lot of you have some worries, you're tired. I see new love is coming in. So for some of you, a baby could be born in this time, in this week. Definitely a baby could be born or some of you are going to get pregnant. A baby could be born or some of you are going to get pregnant. I see that your child misses you and, you know, and hope that they could have been, um, at Christmas with you so that sort of a situation is coming up I see some of you men are very worried because you got yourself in some legal issue and um, some of you could be incarcerated or get incarcerated sometimes within this week and you're not going to be home for Christmas and I see that's kind of a situation I see a Pisces as um, a cancer and uh, um, um, a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn um, I see um, some emotional issues that is going on between these two men um, because it's as if they have done some thing and now they have regret so a cancer and um, a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn have done something and now they have some regrets because I and you guys are also connected you men 45 years and older and men between the ages of 18 and 45 have connected with these people to do something. And I see um, worries is coming up and I see you're hoping for the situation to be ended because I see that you are in some really serious problem. OK, so remember, ladies and gentlemen, if you think that, um, you know, you can do things and get away with it. You need to um, start wake up because the world has changed. Open your heart. I allow myself to feel the full range of emotion, especially all forms of love, especially all forms of love. So whatever the issue is and the situation is, uh, um, there's lies and deception that a cancer a Taurus Virgo or Capricorn has done now they are having regrets because they're on the investigation so um, really they want a situation to be over the situation won't be over because uh, they are on the investigation for something that they have done so um, men 45 years and older together with a cancer and a Taurus Virgo or Capricorn have done some illegal things and I see that an investigation is taking place and some of you are going to be ending up in jail now you know this is something to show that God do not like ugly whatever the issue the situation is I see an investigation is taking place against you men and men 45 years and older who have connected with a Cancer, a Taurus, Virgo, or a Capricorn man, 45 years and older, you're on the investigation. Alrighty, um, ladies and gentlemen, um, this is the last reading of the year 2020. I want to say thank you for being here. Namaste until next time.